Welcome to EF Pod English, brought to you by EF Education First and English Town. Learn anytime, anywhere. Pod English Pre Intermediate Forty Eight. Checking in. Bag. Bag. Um. Hello. How may I help you? Today we're going to learn some useful vocabulary for checking into a hotel. Reservation, register, and facilities. We're also going to review the passive voice. We'll talk about how we use the passive voice to focus on an object, like, "Your room was cleaned this morning." I believe I have a reservation. Yes. What is your name, please?、Um, I'm with the U.S. Olympic ping pong team. Can you? The U.S. Olympic. What's your、yeah. What's your name? Jackie. Well, it's time for Steve to check into his hotel now. Watch carefully. Hi, my name's、uh, Stephen Clark. I'm here for a pharmaceutical conference. I believe my company has made a reservation for me. Let me just check for you, sir. Have you stayed here before? No, this is my first time.、Uh, is this a new hotel? Relatively new. It was built in 1999. Okay, here's your reservation. You're staying for three nights. Is that correct? That's right.、Uh, did my employer also mention that I'll need an internet connection in my room? Yes, sir. All our rooms have internet connection. Excellent. Is my room ready now? Yes, it was cleaned this morning, sir. If you could fill out the register for me, please. Sure. I have two colleagues who should arrive here tomorrow morning.、Uh, one of them uses a wheelchair. Do you have any facilities for disabled guests? Yes, sir. The lifts, the conference halls, and most of the bedrooms were designed to accommodate disabled guests. Good. I'll need two more reservations for two nights. Can you do that for me? Certainly. Can I take your credit card details, please? Unfortunately, both my credit cards were stolen a week ago. And I'm waiting for replacements.、Uh, do you take、uh, debit cards? Yes, that's fine. Thank you, sir. If you wait for a second, I'll have someone show you to your room. Thank you for the U.S. Olympic ping pong. Yep. Hmm. I'm sorry, Jackie. There is no reservation for the U.S. Olympic ping pong. Let's look at some words which may be new to you from the movie. Reservation. When you ask a hotel or a restaurant to hold a room or table, register. A register is a list of names that is kept for records. Facilities. These are the services or equipment available at a place like a restaurant or a spa. Now let's look at some examples in the movie of the passive voice. Is my room ready now? Yes, it was cleaned this morning, sir. Is my room ready? Yes, it was cleaned this morning. The question is in the active voice, but the answer is in the past passive voice. We often ask a question in the active voice. If you want to focus on the object, then you use the passive voice. Here, the object is the room. Who cleaned the room isn't important. But the fact that the room was cleaned is. Here's another example from the movie. The lifts, the conference halls, and most of the bedrooms were designed to accommodate disabled guests. The lift, conference halls, and most of the bedrooms were designed to accommodate disabled guests. The answer tells how the lifts, conference rooms, and bedrooms were designed, not who did it. So the focus is on the objects. Remember, in the past passive voice, we use was, were, and the past participle, like this example from the movie. Unfortunately, both my credit cards were stolen a week ago. Good work. Well, now it's your turn to try. What? How is that possible?、Um. Okay. Okay. No, I'm sorry. There is no reservation. Any U.S. people? 
Um, but isn't this the official Olympic hotel? Yes. So, Olympic athlete, Olympic hotel. I am terribly sorry, but there is no reservation. But we could, we could probably arrange something in our conference room for you. We can set up a bed in there, and it will be very comfortable, I'm sure. Uh, Fill in the blank using the verb under the sentence. Is my room ready? Yes, it was cleaned this morning. Read the question. Fill in the gap in the answer. Can I take your credit card details, please? Unfortunately, both my credit cards were stolen a week ago. Now let's see if you remember those words we looked at in the beginning. Fill in the gap. We need to make a reservation to stay in a room at this hotel. What about here? Can you think of a word which might fit in this blank? Good work! This hotel has a great pool and many other facilities. So, could you double check on that reservation for me, please? Oh, okay, I'll check it one more time. I'm afraid we don't have a booking in the field, US, on Olympic. Um, but we can arrange. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, you're the official Olympic hotel. I'm an Olympic athlete. I'm, I'm terribly Therefore, sorry. Therefore, I, 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 I tell you what, I think we can arrange some temporary accommodation for you in our conference room. We'll set up a, a bed and we we'll perfectly... Conference? It's ridiculous. My whole team, my whole team is staying at this hotel. U.S. Ping Pong Team. Hello. Well done. Today we've learned some important words that we need when we check into a hotel. Like reservation, register and facilities. We've also learnt how to use the passive voice to give more information about an object. Like this sentence. Your room was cleaned this morning. Or this one. My passport was stolen last week. Um, I don't know what to say, but there is a, a very nice smaller hotel just one block away from here. They have excellent facilities. They have a elevator, uh, they have I'm sorry, a mini bar I, I don't everywhere. think you understood. Our whole team is staying at this hotel. So I am staying at this hotel. Um, I have a few requirements for my rooms and every place I stay have the same. So I basically need to have a bubble bath, I need to have a massage at 9 p.m. and I need to have a sea view. So if you could arrange that, that would be great. Um, I can't. Thank uh, you. The bubble bath would be difficult to set up in the conference room, but uh, I can probably arrange a very nice picture of the sea. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, um, John. I'll be back. Okay. I'm gonna just step out. When I get back, I'll be ready to check into my room. Thank you. Bag. Good work. See you soon.